great thing about the plancher grill is that as well as cooking the traditional barbecue things like the steaks, the burgers that I did, you can also cook things that are a little bit more tricky to cook in a barbecue, like seafood. I've got delicious mackerel, I've got prawns and squid. First, I'm going to put the prawns on to cook and I've got gorgeous, big, juicy prawns that are sitting in some olive oil, a bit of salt and pepper and chopped herbs. And I'm cooking them in the shells so they'll take a few minutes on each side. I've got the mackerel, a few fillets of mackerel here, sitting in some melted butter with some chopped herbs. I've got parsley and thyme, and also there's a little bit of olive oil in there. I'm putting it flesh side down, and I like to cook it with the skin on. You don't have to, but the skin does get really nice and crispy, and it's really good for you. The squid, once it hits the hot grill, it curls up really quickly. There. It's a good idea to score it so it doesn't curl up and toughen too much. Yes, gorgeous golden brown. Whew. And you'll notice that when anything is cooked on one side, like mackerel, lamb chops, steak, then you can turn it. If it starts sticking to the grill, it's not ready to turn, it's not cooked. The prawns take a few minutes on either side, that's why I put those on first. Let the prawn shells get nice and golden. The squid, you see, turn it once it's nice and golden brown. And the mackerel at this stage is cooked so fast on this. So I'm going to turn this side of the grill off, put the mackerel to the side so I can just keep warm. Squid can go to the side, that's cooked. I'm serving the squid on some rocket leaves and I've got a really good oil, chili and parsley oil. So chopped red chili, lots of parsley, extra virgin olive oil. And that I'm going to drizzle around the edges. Like that. That's great. And then the prawns, just served as they are in the shell. Let people peel them, help themselves. Really, something as simple and stunning as that. That's all you need, that's perfect. And then the mackerel, because the mackerel's been cooked in a herb butter anyway, I'm just serving that with a wedge of lemon. That's it.